not in vain. 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verses 54 to 58. So when this corruptible has put on incorruption and this mortal has put on immortality, then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written, Death is swallowed up in victory. O death, where is your sting? O Hades, where is your victory? The sting of death is sin, and the strength of sin is the law. But thanks be to God who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my beloved brethren, be steadfast, immovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, knowing that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. 1 Corinthians 15, Paul is addressing this overarching issue of death. We know we all will have to die someday, that death will come. But he says, there's something greater than that, that one day we know that our Lord will cause us to conquer death, that our bodies will be raised up incorruptible. That, Im that mortal will put on immortality and death will be conquered, that we will conquer death. The Lord Jesus already conquered death in His resurrection, but we too will pass by that same way, resurrected and come alive with glorified bodies, and death will have no more claim over us. So in view of that, He says, you know what? Let's celebrate. Thanks be to God. He is giving us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. And therefore, he says, be steadfast, immovable, unshakable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, because you know that your labor in the Lord is not in vain. Now, think about it. This could be the, the, the heart, the, the last thing that could happen to anybody, death. Compare that with all the other things in life. So if this is our view of death, then so should this be this so should our view be of other situations and circumstance in life. That no matter what we go through, thanks be to God, He will give us the victory. And in view of that, the fact that God is going to cause me to win, I will continue unshakable, being steadfast, unmovable, always abounding the work of the Lord because I know that my labor in the Lord is not in vain. So I want to encourage you, whether it's death or whether it's anything else in life, nothing is going to win. You and I are going to win. God will give us the victory. And therefore, whatever we do, let's keep doing it with all our heart, mind, soul, and strength for the Lord, because our labor in the Lord is not in vain. In every situation, keep a winning mindset, because God will ultimately cause us to win. We choose to win. He will cause us to win. Let's work with a winning mindset because nothing, our labor in the Lord, is not in vain. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you that you will give us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. And therefore, with a winning mindset, God, help us to always abound in the work of the Lord, knowing that our labor in the Lord is not in vain. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.